Hey guys, I have something exciting to share with you today. I received my Amazon welcome box for uh, signing up for their baby registry. So I am a Prime member and I believe that this box is only um, sent to those who are a Prime member. I could be wrong, but you basically get this box when you sign up, um, you do a baby registry through Amazon, and then there's a checklist of things that you have to do to get the box. Like I think you have to purchase one thing that's like $10 off the list, probably just to verify that you're actually like doing this because you're getting having a baby. Um, and then a few other little things. But yeah, I just got mine. It got here super quick. So I thought it'd be really fun to go through and see what we have in here. I haven't looked at mine, but it's all packaged up super nice. And I think it's so cool that they do this. I know that Target will give you some kind of a welcome box if you um, do a baby registry through them. And we may do one through them, I'm not sure. Um, and let me know if there's any other places where you can get like free boxes, cause I mean, this is fun. A lot of times I think the stuff's kind of like maybe crap, but I've heard there's some really great things in this one. So let's see. We got a yellow onesie. I believe everything is just gender neutral, but that's pretty cute. It says 10 bucks and it's a three to six month little onesie with little ducks. I'm not someone who is huge into gender neutral colors like that, like the yellows and I don't know, you would think I would since I'm not finding out the gender of our baby, but I don't know. I just don't, I'm not so into it, but I can always pass that along to someone or maybe I'll use it. Who knows? You, I got a Pampers. It kind of looks like a diaper bag maybe. Um, yeah, I'm not going to open this. I think it just looks kind of like a diaper bag and it has coupons in it, it says. It does come with a bunch of coupons here as well. You get some binkies and these are the Nuke brand. I plan to breastfeed, so probably won't use these too much, but I think it's always nice to have these kind of things on hand, especially if you can get them for free. Um, just because you never know. You can't really plan it out. You don't know if you could have a breastfed baby that wants binkies um, if you choose to give it to them kind of thing. So it's nice to have that stuff on hand. You get a little Burt's Bee shampoo wash for the baby. Um, here, let me show you something that's really awesome. This is what I was um, expecting. This is a muslin swaddle blanket and this one has little uh, zebras on it. I'm gonna take this out and see. So this is what I was most excited about. Now I've seen people get different prints or I've seen some people not get any at all, but oh my gosh, this is adorable. And while I'm not, I'm also not into like prints with like characters or I know little animals are cute. I'm just not so into it, but this blanket's cute and it's actually, it feels nice, nice quality. It's pretty big, so it's just a swaddle blanket, but it's a muslin swaddle. And uh, yeah, I am really excited for this. If you guys have a favorite brand of muslin blankets, please let me know. I think the Aiden and Annie's, if that's how you say it, is one of the more popular brands, I think, and I have a few from them. Um, but let me know, because I know there's so many good brands, especially like on Etsy and stuff. This is cool. You get some daily cleaning wipes uh, from Lysol. That's cool. Uh, you get some wipes. Even though we're going to cloth diaper, we'll probably use disposables in the beginning or, um, you know, I can always use these for cleaning up messes and stuff. I used cloth wipes with Alistair, so I don't know. Um, you get a bottle, an Avent bottle. I think I got one of these recently when I had bought a bunch of clothes from Motherhood. So that's cool. You get a little lotion for the baby. Um, another little lotion from Aveeno. I like the little sample sizes because these are nice to throw in your diaper bag. And then, we're almost done here. Uh, you get a breastfeeding guide, I'm not too sure. I think it comes with some um, <clears throat> storage bottle, or some storage um, bags for your milk. So that's cool. I actually was just looking into ordering my breast pump. Uh, also let me know down below if you are, if you're nursing right now or going to have a baby, uh, what type of breast pump you are getting. Um, I was looking at the Medela Pump and Style. I think that's the one. Um, so 
I was, my insurance covers it, thankfully, so I was looking into that. Okay, this is pretty darn cute. So you get one more onesie here, and this is, it says that it's an organic cotton. Now this looks really nice. So some of the reason why I don't like some onesies, like Carter's brand, and there's some other brands, because I feel like the fit is really odd, but this looks really like tall and slender, which maybe that probably, maybe I'm just into that because... Alistair was like super tall um, and I'm really long. <laughs> I mean, I'm almost six foot, so my baby's probably gonna be long, maybe not. But um, yeah, I feel like some of the other brands like Carter's and stuff are super short and they just don't, they didn't work for Allie. But this looks really nice. It's organic cotton and it is by the brand Moon and Back. It came in this little box and it's pretty cute. I like it. So I'm very happy with this box. I mean, it was all free, and I am super excited for the swaddle blanket. I think that's my favorite part. So let me know if you got a box, did you get something different, or did you get the same things? And if you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed, please do. I make videos like this all the time, baby videos, pregnancy update videos. I have a bunch of videos on infertility and just like kind of mom life type videos here. And then I have a craft channel called I'm a Cool Mom where I make crafty videos. That's my main channel. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.